Imagine unlocking the full potential of your body's natural growth hormone, enhancing muscle growth, improving recovery, and even slowing down aging. CJC1295 and Apomorolin, when combined, form a powerhouse duo that can take your performance and physique to the next level. But how does it work? Is it safe? And why is this combo considered one of the most effective growth hormone secretagogues available? Stay tuned, because we're diving deep into the science, benefits, and potential risks of this game-changing combination. What are growth hormone secretagogues? Before we get into CJC1295 and apomorolin, let's first understand what growth hormone secretagogues, GHS, are. These compounds stimulate the pituitary gland to produce and release more growth hormone naturally. Unlike synthetic HGH, which introduces artificial hormones into the body, secretagogues like CJC1295 and apomorolin encourage your body to do the work itself, leading to more sustainable and regulated hormone levels. Why does this matter? Growth hormone plays a crucial role in metabolism, muscle growth, fat loss, and overall recovery. As we age, GH production declines, leading to slower recovery, increased fat accumulation, and decreased muscle mass. That's where these peptides come in. What is CJC1295? CJC1295 is a synthetic peptide that functions as a growth hormone-releasing hormone, GHRH analog. Simply put, it stimulates the pituitary gland to increase the release of growth hormone over an extended period. But what makes it unique? Unlike traditional GHRH, CJC1295 has a drug affinity complex, DAAC, which significantly extends its half-life, lasting up to a week. This means fewer injections and a more sustained GH release, making it incredibly effective for muscle growth, fat loss, and anti-aging benefits. Key benefits of CJC1295 increases GH production naturally, enhances muscle growth and recovery, improves sleep quality and cognitive function, aids in fat loss and metabolism regulation. But here's the thing, CJC1295 alone isn't enough for optimal results. That's where ipamorelin steps in. What is ipamorelin? Ipamorelin is another peptide, but unlike CJC1295, it works as a growth hormone-releasing peptide, GHRP. Instead of just stimulating GH release, ipamorelin specifically targets ghrelin receptors, which play a key role in hunger and growth hormone release. What makes ipamorelin special is its selectivity. It increases GH levels without raising cortisol or prolactin, which are hormones that can lead to stress, water retention, and unwanted side effects. Key benefits of ipamorelin Triggers GH release without affecting other hormones helps burn fat and improve lean muscle retention, enhances recovery and reduces inflammation, boosts deep sleep and improves skin elasticity. Why combining CJC1295 and ipamorelin is a game changer? Individually, CJC1295 and ipamorelin are powerful, but when combined, they create synergistic effects, amplifying each other's benefits. Here's why this combo is superior. Long-lasting and pulsatile release. CJC1295 ensures a steady GH release, while ipamorelin triggers rapid pulses, mimicking natural secretion cycles. Increased fat burning. The combination enhances lipolysis, making fat loss more efficient while preserving muscle. Faster recovery and repair. Athletes and bodybuilders notice improved healing times, reduced soreness, and better performance. Anti-aging and cellular regeneration. Increased GH levels improve skin elasticity, hair growth, and joint health. This isn't just for bodybuilders. Anyone looking to optimize their hormones for health, longevity, and peak performance can benefit from this combination. Dosage and administration. Dosage is crucial when using these peptides. Typical dosage recommendations are CJC1295, DAC, 2 milmiagons injected once or twice weekly, ipamorelin, 200 to 300 mcg per injection, taken two to three times per day for optimal GH pulses. Consistency is key. Most people cycle for eight to 12 weeks to see the full benefits. Side effects and safety considerations. While this combo is much safer than synthetic HGH, it's not without potential side effects. Some users may experience water retention, temporary numbness or tingling in hands and feet, fatigue in the first few weeks, possible appetite increase due to epimorolin's effect on ghrelin, However, unlike HGH, CJC1295 and apomorelin do not shut down natural GH production. They enhance it. But as with any performance-enhancing peptide, proper cycling and consultation with a medical professional are essential. If you're serious about optimizing your performance, recovery, and overall health, 
this peptide stack is worth considering. But remember, no supplement or peptide can replace proper training, nutrition, and sleep. If you enjoyed this breakdown, hit the like button, subscribe for more deep dives into performance enhancement, and turn on notifications so you never miss a new video. Want to see more peptide breakdowns? Drop a comment below.